Guys, welcome back to the channel. So today we're taking a look at this wheel strap tie down kit from Trekacy. This has four big ratchet handles and it comes with six straps to tie down wheels, tires to trailers. So let's get these things unboxed and I'll show you how they work. With the straps all laid out here, you see you get six of these eight foot long web straps. They have these big D-rings on there. So we'll get these uh, opened up and show you how they go on the tires. But these ratchets, very heavy duty ratchets, big 16 inch change, big heavy duty hooks to wrap it on, to hook it onto your trailer, and big four inch handles on the end of the ratchets to be able to crank down those straps. And then a nice carrying bag to be able to put all of your uh, ratchets and straps in when you're not using them. So let's get these open, we'll get these unpackaged, and we'll get them on the tires. So these straps are the, this includes six of these straps. These are 96 inches long, two inches wide. They have a 3,300 pound working load strength, 10,000 pound brake load strength. This has a four inch handle here. This is a 16 inch chain on the ratchet part. These straps are long enough also to be able to be able to wrap it around the, the, the wheel of most car tire sizes. So that way you'll, you won't have to have a different size for different tires. Multiple tires, multiple sizes will work with this. Let's take us over to the car and let's see how they work. Okay, so here we have our tire. So this is about a 32 inch tire and this will actually work really well for it. So what we'll do is we'll, if we just make a, a loop with our tie down before we put it around and then we put it around. We want the, with this type of, with this type of system we want to do, we want the straps to be about at the, the two o'clock and 10 o'clock positions on the tire. I just want to make sure that the, like that. And if this D-ring is just a little bit off to the side, that way when we cinch it down, it'll be in the middle. So we want it about, we want this to be about in the middle. We want our D-ring to be about right in the middle of this. So we've got a little bit of, we've got a, we have some excess strap length right here to be able to ratchet with. Then we take our, we get our handle here, open it up. And we have 16 inches of length here. What we could do with this, with this here is we could actually, uh, we could wrap this around a D-ring and come back up to the chain link here. Or we can just hook this right into a, a pocket stake, a D-ring, some kind of anchoring point on our trailer. So we're just gonna take our strap length, pull it through here. Tuck the excess out the back, and then we're going to pull this tight here. We're going to anchor this down into our anchoring spot. Now that we have this pulled tight, we want to get all the slack out of it. Pull this tight, and then we can just release this inner, this smaller handle. That's going to release the handle. Okay, we, with, with one hand holding the excess strap through, pulling that tight, the other hand we can use to ratchet this down here. And we can just set that down like that. If we have any excess strap, we can just tuck it right through there. Okay, so with that on our anchoring point there, come up here. Okay, we're able to see that's nice and snug there. That's going to hug the tire and it's going to keep it nice and secured. So another way we can do this, instead of going around the tire, we can actually just go through the wheel. So this wheel has, you can see it has some bigger openings to it. So if that's the case, we could take the strap and just put it right through, right through the wheel. Okay, reach to the other side and pull it through. And then we can just slip the end through our D-ring. Okay, so get it right through there, pull it nice and tight, and then we can put our ratchet on there. We can ratchet that down more of a front-facing one. So we could do one in the rear, we could do one on the front tire. So if you have the wheels that have this open area, this is a nice way to do that. Also, this is also gonna be helpful for axles. If you just wanna wrap it around the axle, if you have a solid rear axle or some kind of other frame mounting point, maybe on a custom vehicle where you have access to that, you could do that as well and ratchet those right down. And you can see how this would also work on a bigger tire. This is a big 40, uh, the big uh, third, this is a 34 inch, more of a all terrain, more aggressive tread pattern tire. But it fits pretty well on this. If we just get it at that 10 and two position and we just kind of pull those, pull it tight here. Wanna make sure that it's not 
twisted at all around the tire. And then we have we do have enough we have enough strap length here that we could just put the ratchet on there, ratchet it down. We'd need to have a close mounting point. It doesn't give them this is going a ton of extra space, but they also sell a kit that has the 12 foot length straps. These are the eight foot. These are the eight foot long ones. You could also get 12 foot long ones if you needed extra length. So everything's loaded in the bag here. This has a nice drawstring bag. The top tightens up like this, and everything fits pretty. It's pretty heavy once everything's loaded in there. But it's nice to have a bag to carry everything to keep it keep it secured, nice, organized. You have it all in one spot, and you can carry it easily. All right, guys. Well, thanks for watching the video. Hope you found that helpful. This is a great heavy-duty package. This is what you need if you're going to be hauling a, hauling a vehicle on a trailer or strapping something down, a vehicle, car, truck, SUV, some kind of ATV like a Razor or something. Strapping your tires down with this kind of strap system is going to work great. These big heavy-duty hooks on the ratchets, 16-inch long uh, chain on here. These big heavy-duty uh, D-rings, and then really sturdy straps. 10,000-pound brake strength on the on, on all of these straps. So this comes with six straps. Pretty easy to use. Also, this is an easy system to be able to wrap it around the tire like this and really ratchet it down and get it tightened down. So anyway, see the link down below. Hit that thumbs up button. Subscribe to the channel. And we'll see you in the next one. Thanks. Thank you.